Okay guys, I hope everybody's enjoying uh, some nice weather. Got a whole bunch of blanks here. Um, some Yale, some uh, small pin Yale stuff. Really weird Corbin blank that took a really a couple months, almost a month to get. Um, another Yale. Uh, these are some Yale push keys. Got a couple Corbin cores here. These are Rustwin N10 blanks. So, um, Get that keyed up eventually. Uh, this, I got these blanks from uh, ADI Picker on Lock Picking 101 from Australia. I'm gonna modify them to fit uh, this keyway. He sent them out twice. The first blank didn't show up, so he sent, it, sent me another one, and then they both ended up showing up at the same time. And I got some WBC keyway blanks because I had ordered some other stuff, so just to uh, utilize the shipping. Uh, this came from Bobby Keys. He made me uh, three of these plug followers. Uh, for the Kava Peak small pin or small diameter plug. So I'm going to try these out of work tomorrow. And he also made me this box. I asked him if he could make me one that does not uh, have any dividers. So he made it with a, a lid on the side there. I'm going to use that. Should be able to fit some tap handles and some other miscellaneous stuff in my tool bag. And then the, the pinning tray on the top is a great bonus. Uh, this came from Mac. Uh, at first it looks like a Corbin mortise or sorry rim cylinder but it's actually a removable core um, they have not they didn't make these very long um, that's actually what the other blanks are for he's got a mortise cylinder but uh, it uses a longer key if I can uh, you can see that there this is why Bill sent me that tripod years ago So this turns, maybe, that way, and then it comes out. Uh, so really cool. Thank you again, Mac, and uh, you should have those blanks soon. And then this came from Nemo Griff. Uh, he needed some Medico pins uh, to match a set of keys, so he sent me some to keep and this nice WB. Uh, looks almost brand new. He said he polished it, but it looks like it came from the factory. So thanks for watching. Check out locksmithforum.com and check out keypicking.com.